Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen of Australia. Your old mate, Dan the Poet here, from Hillsville, Victoria, at the base of the Dandenong Ranges, down at my daughter's place, sitting on the back porch, having a nice beer, and reciting a bit of poetry for you. I suppose I'm going to put the stubby down and get on with it, eh? This is a piece of bush poetry and it's written tongue in cheek with a grin. The title is The Wombat. So here we go. Do you know a wombat that lives there in your street? Did he say his name? is Wally, when the wombat you did meet. And did he smile and greet you with a wombat's cheesy grin and ask you in to have a beer and then pour you a gin? And did you then get pickled and have a laugh that day. Your funny bone he tickled. For that's the wombat's way. Then later you discovered that it was hard to think when later you recovered from a wombat's kind of drink. When you were cooking dinner, you heard the doorbell ring, and who was there but Wombat, with a Wombat's cheesy grin. So in you did invite him, with his chuckling and his cheer. When you ask him what he's laughing at, he says, I bought the beer. You stare at him somewhat perplexed. His idea of a beer is gin. It's then you become somewhat vexed as Wombat's cheesy grin. He says it's there, it's right outside. I left it on the porch. It's there all right, a box of light down roads that Wombat's scorch. He eats your grub and drinks the beer. Then see he has to go. When you inquire, he laughs and says, there's a lady that I know. A week goes by and there he is. You meet him in the street. He quickly whispers in your ear, there's someone you should meet. And there she is, so full of cheer, she swept him off his feet. He said, my dear, just have a beer, for that's how wombats meet. Now, is that a lot, Dr. Wright?